So, hey, Daddy's Treasures. I hope you guys are having a great day and a wonderful Sunday. So, I wanted to come on and show you guys um, how we are turning just a few pennies into great profit for us for Mother's Day. So, uh, as you can see, I have a lot of flower arrangements here uh, on this table. And you guys, I cannot take credit for these. Um, my kid's godmother is very gifted, as you can see, with flower arrangements. And she offered to help me by making these flower arrangements because I did not have time to uh, make any, um, especially while I'm trying to make gift baskets as well. So she um, helped me in making these beautiful flower arrangements. If you guys can see, I think they turned out gorgeous. She did an excellent, excellent job. And she's still working on um, more. This is just a few of some of the ones that she's made so far. Um, we've made about, she's made, she's made about 16 so far and she's still working on more. So, and the reason why I said just a few pennies, you guys, the majority of these flowers, um, came from Dollar General and the, uh, majority of these, uh, flower bases, these were this right here. And I know this one, these were like vases that we got from dollar general that already had flowers in it and she just kind of rearranged and added flowers to make them uh you know uh better improve the look of them and these pots right here um the this pot came from dollar general as well and um she, she added the flowers so um probably the last couple of years you guys know when the flowers pennied out at dollar general um, I was able to find a ton of flowers, you guys. I have, oh man, I had baskets and baskets of flowers. So um, I just let her loose with the flowers that I had collected. And uh, she was able to make these gorgeous arrangements. So some, uh, just a few of them, you know, I did buy it 90%. But for the most part, I waited until they pennied out. And then I went back and collected these. Some of the little arrangements, even the uh, pot, you know, I may have bought them um, either at 90% or at one penny. And then, you know, like I said, we, um, she rearranged them and made them into these beautiful, beautiful fire arrangements. So these little picks here, I got these from Timu. Um, I got these last year after Mother's Day because I knew I wanted to make some flower arrangements for this year. But I had to order some more picks because we're making more flower arrangements than I had picks. So I'm waiting on the other um, Mother's Day picks to come in for us to include with these arrangements. And some of the arrangements like these pots right here, we're going to add something to the pot, you know, to kind of make it a little more um, festive because I don't really like the way that pot looks. Um, but, um, you know, for now, that's kind of the, the start. Like I said, this is another one of those uh, black canisters. And I only had one white canister. And I had, like I said, I have some more um uh, flower arrangements in the attic that I have to pull down for her to finish. She's going so fast. So, um, yeah, it's been, um, I mean, she's been doing an excellent, excellent job. So anyway, you guys, I just wanted to come on and show you guys these, uh, flower arrangements that we're doing. And this is, like I said, this is kind of the beginning, uh, of them. Some of them, we're going to add different things to them. Um, you know, some candies and different things like that. Um, but for right now, that's kind of, we just kind of built up the flower arrangements to kind of see what else we want to do, uh, to them. And it, of course we'll, we'll make great, great profit off of these flower arrangements. So you guys, I hope you guys are having again, a wonderful Sunday and, um, still working on your baskets and your gifts, uh, ideas for mother's day. And I hope everything is going well for you. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.